Hi everyone, thanks for coming to Pot About with me today. I'm just gonna do a quick video on one of my African violets, which is in bloom. It's a miniature vintage variety called Cupidon. Now, I've had this plant for, well, the parent plant I've had for about maybe eight to nine months now, and it's taken just a very long time for me to get the conditions right in order to get it to bloom. But I've managed to do it and I'm quite happy with the plant itself and the actual blooms. Um, I really like the colour. Um, I think it's officially described as a, mo a single mauve two-tone bloom that has a white edge. Um, I can't really see any white edge around it. Um, but I can see just on this bloom which is coming out here. I'm not sure if the camera can pick it up but it has almost like a green... A green edge to it on the underside and um, so maybe that's just where the white edge is um, now the plant also has gull um, foliage leaves and um, you can just see them there and I'll put the hybridizers name um, up on the screen just because I'm not sure how to pronounce it um, L Aganites 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 something like that and um, I'll put it up on there um, I did get some information online where it says the seed parent of this plant was candy and the pollen parent was mini mignon. Um, I'll put those names up as well. Um, but it's just quite a little cute plant. Um, the blooms seem to come up in pairs. So there's just uh, on each stalk there's two blooms. So there's two there. This one has two there. And then the one just coming up there has one and two just beneath it. Um, and it's a very small plant. The blooms are about maybe two and a half, two centimeters across and as you can see it just fits in the palm of my hand so a very tiny tiny plant that's in a you can see it's just in a solo cup like a shot glass and it's very very small um, I did want to say as well just in terms of the plant it doesn't seem to be like a single crown plant because like there's all of these just popping up and you can even see there's just blooms coming off here uh, I'll try and get the light maybe a bit better. So you can see there's like a bloom stalk that's coming up there and just underneath it there as well behind that leaf. So um, I, I've, in all the plants that I've managed to get off this one because this is just um, a plant I managed to get off my parent plant which I bought um, just several months ago. There's just so many plants I'm getting off this so it is quite a nice plant to have but um, I do find them quickly ending up with quite a lot of them, so um, I don't think it's a single like crown plant because it seems to just have all these like sucker plants underneath it, which it seems to be doing fine, but um, I guess it just reproduces quickly, which is not a bad thing um, if you want to share your plants with anyone. Um, so basically, that's just the plant there. It's a lovely plant to have in my collection. I, as I say, it's the first time it's blooming, but I'm really enjoying just seeing the colours. I like how small it is and compact. And it's just a very cute little plant. Um, I have it under my grow light. It's not on a wick system, as you can see, um, but... Um, I do water it a couple, maybe two times, at least once a week. Um, I'm trying to do it too because I'm finding as it gets a little bit warmer, um, the plant needs a bit more um, water. But um, anyway, thanks again for watching and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. If you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to subscribe um, just so you get a notification when any new videos are coming up. Um, and if you have any comments or suggestions for me, please don't forget to leave them below. Thanks very much and have a good weekend. Goodbye.